I'm alive, but barely. My voice is still kind of weird, but it's functional. So here we go. This oatmeal has goddamn dinosaur eggs in it, and then when you cook it, the dinosaurs fucking hatch. I'm so pumped. Was this post made in 1996? But is no expiration date. Yeah, but that, uh, that, that oatmeal do, and you probably shouldn't eat it, or you, you, you'll die of dysentery or something. Something from Oregon Trail. Another 1986 joke. Wow, this pepper's way too small. Can you please put a little blanket or a tiny sweater on him? Because he's a little chilly? Ugh. The alphabet is terrifying. A, B, C. No thanks. We're good. I can't even articulate how fucking bad this joke is. I, I think it's fucking comedy gold. You know, it's one thing to be sent a dick pic, but it's fucking hilarious when it also says, Show this to your own thing. That's a thirst of unfortunate magnitude. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, but did somebody seriously send you a dick pic? Didn't open the attachment, but I kind of saw it in the thumbnail preview. On the off chance, it was also a virus. Deleted it and then proceeded to laugh that someone wants to bone a cartoon character so badly they would send the creator their dick. The way you phrased it made it sound like they chopped off their dick and mailed it to you. See, if they did that, maybe I have to fill the request, maybe. Because, Jesus, that's commitment. Ladies, if he's tall, hairy, shredded, has glowing red eyes, and is widely considered to be a bad omen due to having been reportedly sighted shortly before the collapse of the Silver Bridge in Point Pleasant, West Virginia in 1967, that's not your man. That's Mothman. Or if you have taste. That is your man, Mothman. I was in the shower with my boyfriend and he tried to convince me that a bottle of shampoo was a sandwich. It got super heated, I was pissed, so I yelled at him to fucking eat it then. He proceeded to eat the entire thing without breaking eye contact. Once again, read URLs. Oh, thank you, I was extremely confused. It's so stupid. ADHD is dozen vaguely related neuroses in a trench coat, including such popular hits as can't fucking sleep disorder. Can't fucking wake up disorder. What is a focus? Oops, I did it again. Spent 13 hours on YouTube and forgot to eat a drink. Mood. The world is too noise today. All my friends hate me. I deduce this from a three word text. Also mood. I forgot about the thing literally as soon as I turned around. And they decided to call it trouble sitting still disorder. That is a, uh, actually all that right there. Big mood. Me as a pilot. Uh, Siri, how do I land a big airplane in Newark Airport? Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck! I pushed a guard into the river and he immediately died. What is in the water in Venice? See, I didn't know this was about Assassin's Creed at first. I just assumed you were in Venice killing people and casually blogging about it. I mean, it can be two things. Gotta be honest, a lot of hot people go to art museums and I'm one of them. I'm too ugly, they won't let me in. That and my shirt says I eat oil paintings when security guards aren't looking. I'm pretty sure it's because I'm ugly, though. Emails just aren't safe. We should hide state secrets deep in the story parts of recipe blogs. <laughs> you laugh! But that is literally the plot of Full Metal Alchemist. Excuse me? Today I learned to create the battles for Lord of the Rings. Weta used a program called Massive and was able to create thousands of CG soldiers, give them artificial intelligence, talents, and skills, and then just let them fight. The AI works so well that some of the soldiers assessed the battle and fled. Artificial cowardice! I want that program. Because that sounds way better than Epic Battle Simulator. Or Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. Whatever that one is where everybody's got the doofy eyes. Imagine some dumbass swallows an entire raw rattlesnake and dies. Then 1500 years later, archaeologists discover their poop and decide it was a cultural thing. God, I love you, but what the fuck? You can't blame me for this! My parents are asleep. Quick, reblog this post with skeletons saying bad words. Yeah, tax evasion! Movies that don't have music playing in the background a majority of the time feel so awkward and uncomfortable! Maybe this is why life is awkward and uncomfortable a majority of the time. There's no background music. Everything makes sense now! Hmm, it's a red. California, excellent year. It's a late harvest, subtle expression of, dare I say, peach? Exquisite aroma. Yo, he's not old enough for 